Communication is a key. If you want to avoid doing anything that irritating your wife, so, avoids these things at all costs even at your angriest. Number 1. Never criticize or humiliate her. You love her and given commitment to your wife that you will spend your life forever with her. So why criticize her if you are truly loving her? So, don't criticize, insult and don't make them feel dumb. Number 2. Never betray her or be disloyal. Any family member, relatives or outsider that treat your wife with disrespect, you must always have her side. Anything disrespectful then you need to handle instead of betraying or say that you are disloyal, so don't call him or her a liar. Number 3. Never withhold positive comments. Some husbands give their dog more positive feedback than their wife. Your wife always wants to hear some positive compliments, appreciation and comments every day, so whenever you get chance do not miss to express feeling about her and tell her you appreciate how hard she works, or how great she is or she looks great. Number 4. Never pass negative comments to her family members. For any woman the dearest after you, are her family members, parents, so always remember, don't make any negative comment about them because it can serious disturb and damage to the relationship so always be with her be positive and never pass any negative comments to your wife's family members. Number 5. Never say the divorce word. Divorce word needs to never come out of your mouth if want to stay married and want to have a great marriage. When you threaten divorce, you may regret it later. It shows that you're not truly committed to the marriage lasting forever, making your spouse feel rejected and preventing him from feeling safe loving you. Divorce is never something to be expressed unless you've explored every avenue of making it work together. Because cause serious hurt and doubt in his mind and serious damage to the relationship. So never use this divorce word. Like and subscribe for more amazing videos. Thank you for watching.